Billy and Sally Tiny Beanies Lee Tiny Bean get up Tiny Beanies Lee Tiny Bean get up Hey you press that subscribe button if you back Go eat that subscribe button if you back y'all good morning it is monday and i am on my way to work this weekend was a very productive weekend but next weekend is even going to be better because guess what my kid is out of school on the 4th of july the 5th of july and of course the weekend uh and i am off on the 4th of july oh and a chris brown concert is on friday so we are uh working our way up until friday because it's about to be lit and turned up hey so. guys so i officially made it to work now it's one thing that i've been trying to do forever but it's just not working because basically i need to just use my sony camera and i have not been using it so i literally use my iphone to vlog and i have an iphone 15 pro max but i keep using the selfie camera although the three cameras on the back have the best quality Ever. And it's crazy because people message me like, what country do you live in? What country do you live in? And I'm like, what are you talking about? I look at my camera when I'm in the car, I'm on the passenger side <laughs> because I'm using my back camera. So I need to start using my front camera. And I got this little screen to kind of be able to see what I'm doing on the other side. But I just can't get with it right now. So I might have to pull my Sony camera out and really look like a vlogger at this point. Hey guys, happy Tuesday. I'm heading to Kroger to get my little tiny baby some water. Glory is on her way to school, but we had to stop at Kroger. Get some water, not juice, some water uh, for her water cup at school. So we are here and uh, yeah, we about to get some water. All right guys, so I officially made it to work and I usually never get a spot outside at work. Do you guys know that for the past two days, which yesterday was Monday, today is Tuesday, I've been getting a spot outside instead of in a garage. Like, I usually have to park in the garage, and I kind of hate the garage because I'm ready, like, when I leave the building, I'm ready to just get out of my car and go. But I got a spot outside. I'm excited. Today's going to be a great day. Thank God. Hey, guys. I'm officially off of work, and I'm heading to get me something to eat and then get a pedicure before I have to pick Gloria from school. So yes happy to be off one more day in the office and then it'll be the fourth of july so pretty excited and it's crazy because i'm hungry and i want something to eat but on my way home from work it's not that many options on the side of the street that i'm driving on to head home some of the good stuff is on the other side but i always have to make a tough decision like hmm what do i want on this side so I had the choice between McDonald's or Wendy's and I chose Wendy's because I feel like I just had McDonald's and I'm kind of tired of McDonald's. Like how, how often do you go to Wendy's? Not often, right? So let's see what Wendy's has because I'm hungry, very hungry. Where's your... One moment. Why do people act like I told them to work there? Like, you need to sound a little more happy when you take my order, please, and thank you. Let me tell y'all something. If you don't like where you work at, or you are not having a good day, or whatever the case may be, you still need to sound excited in your voice when you speak, okay? I know people go through a lot of things and you can't control what you say or how you sound, 
but I guarantee you whatever you're going through that day comes out in your voice believe it or not so my advice for people who like work in fast food or work somewhere where they don't want to be cheer up okay I didn't ask you to work there I didn't ask you to work there I didn't I really did not at all I don't even know you uh, yeah cheer up okay because I mean at least you have a job and you making money okay display that personality in that voice when you're talking to me on that speakerphone okay because I came here for something and I'm paying for it okay that's it that's all thank you have a good day I always have to like sanitize my hands when I get food because I wash my hands before I leave work. But when I get in the car and I get this food, I'm about to tear this food up. <laughs> okay, so whatever germ is on my hand is going in my mouth. Please believe that. But I do have sanitizer in every door in my car, so I do sanitize my hands. And if I have wipes, I do the work. Okay, Wendy. Okay. A little light skin fry. I could get into it. If you know me, you know I mess with root beer very heavily. I love root beer. Dang, Wendy, your fries are fire. Oh, and if you have an Apple credit card, it's best to use your Apple credit card. Not I need gas. Again, I just got gas, bro. How much gas? Mm -mm. Now I got to go get gas. Now you guys come with me on another stop while I get gas. Again. Anywho, if you have an Apple credit card and you go to like fast food places or places where somebody else is going to be handling your car and you're not able to do tap and pay, I highly recommend um, using your Apple credit card because the Apple credit card has no numbers on it. It doesn't even have a tap option. It just has a chip. I don't know if they uh, created one that has a tap option, but um, I like to use that credit card because can't nobody be taking pictures of my stuff or doing nothing crazy with it. So if you have an Apple credit card, go ahead and do that. I don't even know what I got. It was like, Asiago ghost pepper something. Mm -mm. Is that American cheese slice? Mm -mm. They got some American cheese on, on a little chicken sandwich. Let me not complain because I really don't care. I'm just hungry. Y'all know, baby, I can eat. And I'm going to. It's actually pretty good. And spicy. I love spicy chicken sandwiches, but you know who spicy chicken sandwich I'm tired of? It's Chick-fil-A. For some reason, I don't know what it is. I do not like Chick-fil-A anymore, y'all. But I did have this new chicken sandwich, this grilled chicken sandwich, like maple bacon chicken sandwich they had. I had it yesterday. I didn't vlog it because I was just too hungry, so it was just a order and eat kind of thing. But um, it was actually pretty good. It didn't taste like the regular Chick-fil-A. So I really enjoyed that. This one is very hot. Hey guys, I was going to the nail shop to get a pedicure, but I saw this place called My Waxing and Threading. And look what I got. I got henna. So if you guys are ever in this area, I'm going to drop the name of this business and a phone number below so you can come and get you some henna. You can get your eyebrows waxed, threaded, whatever you need. This lovely lady here will take care of you. Peace out. 
so I'm picking my daughter up from school. Now, mind you, I just got my henna and my pedicure. Why I was checking my like transactions on my credit card, the henna didn't go through. So I went back inside to tell the lady like, hey, you know, I didn't see it on my transaction history. She had me to come on the other side of the register and show her how to void the transaction and then ring it back up. She rung it up as cash, although I paid her with the card. So yeah, I helped her and you know, I was honest because my integrity is too high to be lying or stealing. You hear me? Hey guys, happy Wednesday. And it's finally Wednesday, July the 3rd. Um, I literally just came from my daughter's school to help her do her little swim day. So now I'm on my way to the office and um, look at my henna. It's not as dark as I wanted it, but it did darken up a little bit. So I'm hoping that it gets darker by today because if not then i'm gonna have to go back up there and have her to kind of like redo it but i'm loving it already though i just wanted it super dark she just said that this one lasts longer so yeah today's my last day that i have to go into the office so i'm very excited about that because lord these three days be killing me so i'm on my way to the office uh lead the office pick my daughter up from school Hey guys, so I picked Gloria from school and say hey. And we stopped at Brewster's to get some ice cream on this beautiful Wednesday. So, yeah. Hi. Hey guys, welcome back. Hi, Pitney. <laughs> so today is July the 4th and me and Glory are out and about. Um, I'm about to go get the top of my hair redone. Uh, at my stylist house down in Midtown so we are heading out and then when we leave from there we're gonna stop by my mom's house Gloria's grandma's house and her great grandma's house my and my grandma is there as well to go see what they're doing because I think they're barbecuing and then after that we are heading back to our house because we are gonna go to the play place today uh-huh. We left our dog shirt at my mom's house. So yeah, we're like gonna get the that. Okay, yeah, we left his shirt. So we're gonna go over there to see if we can find them. And then later we are going to the what? Bake play. The play place. So we're gonna pick play. Dad up. Yeah, we're gonna pick up my husband, Glory's and dad. And we're gonna put our socks on and we're gonna go to the play place so happy fourth of july everybody we will probably do some uh independence day festivities later on but as of now we are enjoying the off day from work and the off day from school and mommy mom got me a shirt and yeah my mother glory's grandmother got her a fourth of july shirt so we'll show you guys the shirt when we get there and uh yeah see you in a second The bunny. Hi, bunny. Hey, y'all. So I just got my ponytail slay by my hairstylist. So yeah. we heading out. See you next time. See you, bro. Bye bye. bye. We're back, so I got stuff with my ponytail done. Me and Gloria are on the way to Mommy Ma's house, my mother. And I know y'all probably be like, why don't we see your mom as often? Boy, my mom lives so far. I feel like if you live on the other side of the airport, you're not gonna see me that often. I'm sorry. Like, y'all met Jessica in the last video. Why? Because Jessica lives far. And um, Yes, it was a lady, uh, a homeless lady. She wasn't trying to take our money, but she was begging for money. So I was trying to explain to Glory that, you know, people, some people are homeless and, you know, they ask for money on the side of the road. We did interact with the water boys, but this time it was funny because 
I saw on a YouTube video for the news in Atlanta, they were like, the water boys are now, they have a business license or whatever the case may be to sell water. And I remember putting under one of the comments, I was like, can y'all get some Gatorade or some Powerade or something? Because number one, the bottles are a little bit harder. Um, and you know, I buy Gatorade from y'all. So today they actually had some Powerades, which was pretty, yeah, we are approximately two minutes from mom's house. So yeah, my mom lives in Forest Park, so this is a bit of a drive for me because, baby, I am not for driving oh, anywhere park. Hey guys, this is my mom's dog, Chapo. Hi, Chapo. Hi, say hi. Say hi. <laughs> I got him a hug, Mom. <laughs> no. Gonna lick your ears. Was it good, Trap? <laughs> Look at my grandma about the barbecue. Mom in the kitchen cooking. Cooking in the kitchen, kitchen tripping like it's stir fry. <laughs> so yeah, my goal is to go to my mom's house tomorrow and get a plate because I do want some barbecue, but they had just started cooking, so today wasn't gonna be a good day because me and Gloria are on a mission today. Uh, we're gonna go to a play place and then go see the fireworks somewhere later, uh, closer near our house in the Alpharetta area. So. Yeah, I'm pretty excited about that. But yeah, I'm gonna give y'all, you know, all what happened today. And then tomorrow will be a different video on its own because, you know, we're about to vibe out tomorrow at the concert and it's gonna be a ball. So yeah, uh, see y'all in a minute. Peace. Yeah guys, so we promised Glory a play place and we are here to let her play on the 4th of July. So we're here. <laughs> Why you don't want to go in? Here go. Look what Gloria got us on the Fourth of July, y'all. Here we go. One, if I can keep my hands steady. Two, three, three, go. 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 <laughs> mm -mm. I'm gonna just go slow. <laughs> I was saying super hard. Hey guys, so we are at Wills Park in Alpharetta waiting for the fireworks. It's super packed out here. We didn't really come prepared because we didn't bring like too many snacks. So, yeah. Thank <laughs> you. 